Yo, what is going on guys? This is the Rebel Clash Triple Pack. I only purchased one Rebel Clash Triple Pack. And the coin is actually low-key, really nice looking, which I'm pretty excited. I didn't really, they didn't have a promo card that I wanted or that I, I don't even know what the Pokemon is from. I've never seen it before. <laughs> so if that tells you anything, I don't know. All right. But anyway, we're going to get into this, this beautiful triple pack opening. We're going to have one pack of unified minds to add to the pile of packs that I'm gonna be opening so three rebel clash uh, I think there are some cool trainers I can get from there uh, here's the unified minds boom which I'm also not gonna lie I'm not very unified minds I don't even know what you can get in them but rebel clash I know has some cool cards that I wanted to get from it and there's the code card for y'all. I don't need it. Don't want it. Take it. The promo. I I don't know what it is with the promos. But they're always looking like the U letter. They're so bent. Every time. But. Duraludon. 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 I'm pretty sure that's how I'm going to say it. I don't know if it's right or wrong. Don't. Never seen the Pokemon before. The coin as i said looks pretty fly we'll get the tin of coins out to add it to the coin collection it is the second of the sparkly coins which uh look kind of cool we have a very small little collection of coins coming i'm trying to fill up a tin i guess and then move to the next tin but that'll come in time i'm not really i don't really care about coins too much um so we'll start with the unified minds pack because both of the, I think both the other Unified Minds packs were actually really bad. So this is the third triple pack that I'm opening. And of course this one has a white code card in it. But this is the third triple pack I'm opening. That I also broke into a fourth triple pack to disperse to make each triple pack actually have four packs. And yeah, of course it's going to have that. Of course. It's going to have a nice ultra rare in it for us. You know, <laughs> for the last triple pack opening, I guess. Lorantis. Giant Bomb, Bug Catcher, Yanma, Young Goose, my boy. But this pack looks a bit out of whack. Um, hopefully I can bend that back. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Litwick, Drillbur. Caught any reverse, and we got a Rowlet and Alolan Executor. Alolan Executor has really grown on me as probably one of my favorite Alolan or newer type Pokemon besides uh, the Vulpix and the Sandshrew. This is like definitely a third place, if not a three way tie. Al Alolan Executor is just too ridiculous not to like with that stupid neck. <laughs> I absolutely love how ridiculous that Pokemon is now. So, we're going to get into these Rebel Clash openings. But that's pretty cool. Started off with an Ultra Rare. It'd be nice to get... If we can get a second Ultra Rare, that'd be dope. But, uh... Got that green code card. For y'all. Just take it. Take them codes. We've got us here a Lightning Energy... And then a Medicham, a Pokeball, a Pelipper, <laughs> a Magikarp with a Pikachu on the beach. Pretty fly. Stunky. I, okay. Diet. Meditite. Almost flung that Meditite. Grubbin. Wingle. Coughing in the reverse slot. Followed by... Followed by the tease of a Garbodor. <laughs> uh, look at that garbage Pokemon. We got our two packs left. It would be cool to get a second Ultra Rare. Uh, 
So Rebel Clash, I also have, bruh, can I not open packs? I can't. So uh, Rebel Clash, I actually have a Korean booster box on the way. If anyone really likes Rebel Clash, I'm going to be opening a Korean booster box of that at some point on the channel. Because we broke out here. We buying these low cost booster boxes. We ain't, we ain't messing with no English $150 booster boxes. No, we paying $30 for booster boxes. <laughs> Burning Scarf. Growlithe. Impidimp. The Chocolate Looking Bundle Bee. Phantom. Dreepy. Electabuzz is the reverse. And an Apple Ton. An Apple. This is what this Pokemon evolves into? I've never seen Appleton's evolution. This is all brand new to me. So Appleton is what Applin evolves into. And he looked. So he. So he's like a pie? What is this guy? So he's basically like an apple pie, right? Or. So apple ton, so maybe he weighs a lot, so he's a heavy pie. I don't know. I'm gonna quit trying to guess what that Pokemon is. We got us that green code card, baby. What do we get? I actually was apple ton a white code card or a green code card? I don't remember. Morgrim. Morgrim. Never seen that Pokemon before. That must. I haven't seen that Imp Pokemon before either. But I think those two are the same line. Clefairy. Super Mario Galaxy looking art. I like it. Voltorb. Nose Pass. Wingle. Phantom. Wingle <laughs> in the reverse. Followed by that scissor. Imagine if you're just standing out, like, exploring the wilderness or something, and you just find yourself in a Lolan Executor, just just chilling out as a tree starts moving its, its long neck. What if you were out there in, like, a field and you just saw a nose pass? That'd be kind of creepy to be in the Pokemon world. But sometimes if you think about it, you're just walking somewhere, you have a nose pass, you think it's a statue, start moving... I don't know what Nose Pass sounds like, but some kind of weird noises. I don't know. So, yeah, we got our, our bent promo card back there. We got Apple Ton. <laughs> I finally get to know what this Apple Pokemon evolution looks like. It actually looks a lot better than I would have guessed it would. It's got that solar beam. That's a weak looking solar beam, though looks very weak but uh yeah so rebel clash i have a booster box on the way i have multiple different booster boxes on the way we've got uh i actually just ordered not too long ago god i don't even know the names that's the problem i don't even know the because <laughs> they're not in english set names so it's hard for me to remember sometimes it's a uh, fair fairy rise fairy rising something to do with the fairy type pokemon i guess and uh there's an alolan nine tails in it that looks really sick and i want it just to hopefully pull the alolan nine tails ultra rare and that's the whole reason i bought that box there's one called like awakened heroes i don't again i don't know the set in english that it's from for awakened heroes but my guess is going to be it has something to do with like maybe legendaries or something um we got the one rebel clash coming we've got two cosmic eclipse in korean it's called like dream league and then we've got the new uh vivid voltage booster box as well but in korean hopefully i can get fat pikachu out of it I know Korean boxes leave out certain cards like you can't. I'm not sure if you can even get rainbow rares in a Korean box. I think the most you can get from them are like full arts maybe. Not really sure. Um, I'm going to make this airplane out of this card real quick while I remember some other stuff. Uh, we've got the Shining Legends 
uh, Miracle Twin and Legendary Heartbeat booster boxes, and then GX Tag Team, or no, not Tag Team, just Tag, GX Tag, like All Stars or something like that, I don't know. But I have a lot of booster boxes coming. So this is kind of just like some product before then to get out and get some videos on. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I got the Rowlet and Executor, which looks really dope. And I'll see you on our video. Peace.